Okay then, another quick video from me here. This is Jay, I'm your coding tutor, and um, uh, today I'm going to do a quick recording about you know, how to open folders. You know, I teach a lot of beginner students, and many of the students, you know, they are probably even using a computer for the first time. So it is very confusing. Uh, suddenly you have to use a text editor, suddenly you're playing around with folders on your computer. Now for people who can already do it, it seems very simple, but for those who can't do it, it can be very, very confusing. So I was like, okay, we'll do this. Now I'm going to assume that you already installed VS Code on your computer, right? And I, I know this is my website. If you wanna visit and follow me and join me on Discord or something, you know, I gotta say that. Okay, so all right then. So let's go ahead and do that. So first step, now let's assume that you already have a folder. So let me go ahead and um, let me, uh, let's say I have my, um, where is that? Okay, so all right. So let's say uh, this is my project folder, okay? Suppose this is a project folder. Um, right, so suppose this is my project folder, okay? and I need to open this in VS Code. So first option is, first option is open with, okay? Now first option is open with, that is the most straightforward option, that is what I use on a daily basis. So if this is my project, I will go inside this project, I will right click, okay? Now on Windows, uh, Wait, watch, what Windows are we using these days? Uh, hold on. What is the latest version? Hold on. Uh, there are so many versions of Windows now. Windows, which version are you? Right, so on Windows 11, that's where I'm doing the recording. On Windows 11, uh, you don't get the option directly, so you have to click on show more options, and then you get the real menu. On the, in the older Windows, you would get this directly, but now in Windows 11, you have to press the button twice. I'm sorry, that's how it is. And here you'll have many options. One of them is open with code. Okay, so just click on open with code and there it is. The website is open, the code is open and you can start typing or coding, whatever you wanna do, that's that's option number one. So, so there you go, that is option number one. I'm going to repeat that one more time. So this is your project folder, go inside, right click, and then again, show more options, open with VS Code, and there it is, your files are open. So this is how you would go ahead and open a folder in VS Code with option number one. Uh, option number one is open with, okay? Now, the second option then, now the second option is code dot, okay? Now this option is useful like, you know, on some computers, you can't get this open with code option. You know, you might have made a mistake or forgot something when you installed the software. So the second option is you go all the way to the top. Now this is important. You have to click on this white area. Not here, no, not here, no. Okay, you have to click on the white area after the last arrow. Okay, so click here. You'll get a blue highlight. Now immediately, directly go to the keyboard. Don't touch your mouse, don't touch anything else. It has to be blue. And then you are going to type C-O-D-E, okay? And then give a space, very important to give a space, and then press dot. If you do this, you know, usually VS Code will directly open if it doesn't open directly, like how on my computer, please select VS Code and then open it. So that's another option. That's another way to open the folder. But you know what, actually, it's not actually opening the folder, it's opening something else. What is going on here? Huh, hold on, this is actually not correct. Wait a second, wait a second. I thought it happened directly. Oh, it's actually not working. What am I missing here? It was working, right? Wow. 
Wow, okay, this step actually doesn't work. I thought it did. I don't know. I thought that worked, guys, I'm sorry. Uh, looks like this is not, not gonna work anymore. I thought you can just say code and then dot. Should I do card dot slash or something? Let me see. I thought it works. So this method doesn't work. Yeah, I'm sorry, folks. I, I really thought it worked. I remember, you know, you, you could simply go here. Uh, hold on, let me try something else. So then I want to say code. Ah, oh, okay, there are two steps. Right, right, so let me repeat that, guys. Yeah, I don't use this method, sorry, sorry. If, I, if that made me look like a fool, then I am a fool. So sorry about that. So let me repeat that step. So looks like it's more elongated than I imagined. So you're in the folder. Okay, so this is the folder, go inside. So for whatever reason, first option is not working for you. So go to the top, click here, you get the blue highlight, very important, let it be blue. Type CMD, press enter, you get the black window, and then type CODE, and then dot, and press enter. So there you go. That's another way to open the folder in VS Code. It seems like it's a little bit roundabout, but you know, there you go. That's a option number two. So I'm going to repeat that one more time because of my you know, foolishness, I made some mistake in the beginning. So let me do, do it again. This is my project folder. Go inside, click after the last arrow in the white area. Let it be blue, don't touch your mouse. Just go to your keyboard, type CMD. You get the black window and then type C-O-D-E space dot. Dot means current folder. So there you go. That is how you would open VS Code another way. Option number two using code space dot. So that is option number two. So there you go. So that is option number two and that's how you do it. Okay. Now, the third way, third way of doing it, I'm sure there are many more ways, but these are the three ways I know. So other, another option is, you know, open directly from VS Code. So for this, you go ahead and open VS Code directly on your machine, right? Just press the Windows key and then type VS. There you go, you get it. You open it, so it opens. And then here you have a button called Open Folder. So that's or you can go to top, you have open folder here also. They are both the same thing. Either you can use this one or you can use the shortcut here. So I like to use the one on the top left corner. So open folder and then you get your computer. Now where do I keep my project? It's under videos, it's under code to delete and it's under uh, VS Code video and this is the one I want to open. So I want to go inside this one. This is my project folder. And once I'm inside, I will say select folder and there it is. Same thing again. Okay, so let me repeat that. Let me close this folder. Let me close VS Code. I'm going to repeat that step again. So press Windows key, you get the menu, VS, okay. VS Code, okay. Then you have the open folder option here or you can go to the top. You have open folder option here and then you can select this. And where is my project? It's under videos, it's under code to delete, it's under, um, what, where, yeah, here, and this is my actual project. So I'm going to double click, go inside the project, very important to be inside the project, and then I'm going to say select folder. And that's it, that's all there is to it. Those are the three ways on how you can open VS Code um, you know, that's all this video is about. Um, again, you know, if you're already able to do it, this may all sound very silly, like, okay, why is a coding tutor making a video about this? You know, this is obvious, this is easy. But you know, guys, <laughs> I do this day in and night. I've been doing it for 10 years. So I know, I know first time coders, you know, they have all sort of challenges. And one of them is, you know, actually opening the project folder uh, from VS Code. So, you know, we gotta help people out. That's, that's the idea here. So, all right then, so that's all there is to it. And that's the end of this tutorial. Thank you, thank you very much.